apart from the uh, Mazda Bongo I'm working on and doing some work and repairs and um, I've got a new project and uh, to do ham radio yes and this is it it's an FRG7 put this light out it doesn't work and um, I got it at a very very reasonable price so I can use it for parts if I can't get it to fully function but um, we'll see how we go well it don't look too bad inside I'm just going to do some voltage checks um, this switch here the AM switch here looks like it's been altered and it looks like there's um, uh, an FM board been added the other side uh, but there's a relay here I don't, know. I don't know what that does it no idea what that is it's not original anyway so I wonder if that switches something in right so I'm going to power it up and see if that relay gets power for some reason mm, bit odd and uh, it's got a few issues as you imagine but one thing I did find in it was this tobacco tin and in the tobacco tin it's got a circuit board this was wired in and I believe it's a down converter it can receive on VHF you know the 2 meter band and it outputs on the 28 to 30 band I believe and uh, I've disconnected it because I'm not sure you know whether it's a good thing the other thing was strange that the record socket here which I've took out now just there um, had 12 volt DC on it I thought oh that's a bit nasty plug anything in to record if you didn't know that um, there's wires lashed in and all sorts of things there's been a lot of soldering done on the circuit boards um, I've rebuilt the power unit I put new capacitors in here and that seems to be okay so it gives um, the voltages it should do 10 and a half and a 9 volt and um, one thing or another and I'll be just going over the transistors uh, bit by bit checking the voltages I think um, the, one of the main ICs might have failed which is there the, the, the Q106 I think it is um, I've got one on order anyway and I've got some transistors I can use uh, FETs I think they're called um, in the front end if they're gone but um, it's it does some strange things it, I don't know whether I can plug it in probably not I've got to solder some ones back on for there plug it back in but what I'm going to do with the the converter is I'm going to take it out the board uh, take the board out of the tin tobacco tin and um, put some sockets on it so I can connect it up to my other radios to see if it works um, so I might be able to test that but I really need to have a tidy up I'm still working on the car I've been on it for a week now I'm working on the FT8 over here uh, just so much stuff so many projects getting getting out of control now but um, uh, what else would I do in my retirement I've got new springs for the uh, uprated road springs for the um, bongo I've got a new exhaust centre section with flexible hose there. Uh, 
found another water leak on the bongo which is a bit annoying but um, yeah too many things I've not had a chance really to go to any radio clubs never mind one thing I do like about this FRG7 apart from having a digit out on the display I do get a whistle so that works so there's something happening and on the LSB you get whistles and things so I wonder if it's front end <laughs> 